right now. So. Well, I mean, whilst we're um, in the uh, whilst we're in the realm of the animal kingdom, do you? Mm-hmm. I mean, uh, last time when we talked, you struck me as being someone who's quite maybe not spiritual, but spiritual, in touch with himself, in touch with the world around him. Would you say you're at one with nature more these days than when you were younger? Oh yeah, I love. I'm um, nature's really really um um one of my biggest things like you know like i get the other day i was i was painting a wall and, and i painted over a caterpillar and the, and the, literally the whole caterpillar was was like fucking giving it large portions because i painted over it and like oh it was literally just me and i, I, I was like fucking hell because i'd already stitched up a woodlouse and and you know and oh god it's a massacre and I, and, I, and and uh, i think maybe a fly or two and i was like fuck but then when this caterpillar got <laughs> Got painted over by this by me by by Mister fucking cunt, cunt with a big paintbrush. It was wheeling about, and I was like, "Fuck! Oh my god!" So I literally ran out, ran over the garden, got my bottle of water like that, and I was because I didn't, I couldn't find a tap, and I literally started going like that to the little big caterpillar, and I and I washed the whole thing off, and the caterpillar just was just like that, eh, eh, and it was dead. <laughs> anyway. Oh. So I was like, oh no, and I felt completely like broken by it. And I was just like, I was like, I can't believe I just killed cat. That could have been a nice butterfly. It could have been a it could have been something just and I, and I felt a physical actual like remorse and pain for this little tiny caterpillar. Mm. And I put it on a leaf. I think it was an aloe vera leaf, and I got on with the painting. And an hour later after that, I just went, oh, let me just check on the caterpillar. And I, I went over, and it was like that. It was, it was, it was, it was up on up on its feet, and I so I poked it. And it started wiggling about, and I was like, "Oh my god!" As so I went over, it's alive. To the bar, went, hey, look at me! I saved the caterpillar, and he looked at me like I was a nutter. You know what I mean? Um, and I uh, ended up just, just so happy that I'd actually saved the caterpillar from and something that could never survive if you was an insect, like proper white bucket paint you paint your walls with. And it was a tinted caterpillar, and it survived because I saved it. Anyway, then I put it in the grass, and I went home, and I. I showed off to him. I went. I saved a cat, <laughs> and then, and then, and then, um, my bird. She went. Yeah, but our one. We found another caterpillar the day before in the other plant, but it had fallen into the pot and drowned. So it was oh, like, God. oh, fuck <laughs> it, hell, man. Well, you but can't yeah, save them all. I, hey, well, I, this... I, I, I saved one, but the other one died, and I was wondering if, if I. If I hadn't saved that one, would that, that one have stayed alive? Was that the balance kind of thing? You know, so uh, that was the like, that was the yin yang yeah. one. Yeah, so yeah. Very, I am in touch with the the yin and yang and nature and stuff like that. You know, I think with the you know the what sounded like uh, you know insect genocide at your home the other day. I mean, I find the same thing with uh, this morning. There was a snail climbing up a wall at work and I plucked the snail and I said, there's, oh. no, there's no food for you up there, little guy. Let me rescue you like a, like a snail Jesus. And then oh, as I went God. to put him down, he slipped from my hand and his shell cracked on the floor. And I thought, oh no, I'm not Jesus. I'm the devil. You're a snail killer. Nothing I'm makes you killer when the feet hit the ground and I hear the crunchy sound. I'm a snail killer. <laughs> Nothing makes you killer. Yeah, that's the song I wrote. It's a song right. about killing, accidentally killing snails, and you've got a completely out of focus. But yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm so I'm so blown away by your snail story. That is such a yeah. I've got a song called Snail Killer because I I remember like killing snails by accident it was so painful that I wrote a song about it, and that's that's uh, uh, there you go. I, I'll, I'll sing you the first verse. It's, it's such a silly song, but it, it's become one of the best ones. Um, Please. Walk, walk in the night, raining in the park It was night time, so of course it was dark I was thinking about what I'd have tomorrow for lunch Then under my foot I heard a nasty crunch I'm a snail killer Nothing makes me iller when my feet hit the ground And I hear the crunchy sound I'm a snail killer Nothing makes me iller Yeah No, 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 no Went with my girlfriend on a trip to France, couldn't read the menu, so I took a chance, picked one at random, it was escargot. When I saw my dinner, I was ready to blow. I'm a snail killer. Nothing makes me iller when my feet hit the ground and I hear the crunchy sound. I'm a snail killer. Nothing makes me iller. Yeah. Down, down, down. Follow the trail, cause I kill snails. Put me in jail, don't release me on bail. 
I kill snails, <laughs> put me in jail, then release me on bail, because my mind's on frail. <laughs> Come and laugh first. Uh, mowing the lawn on a sunny day. Super sad snail gets in my way. Shell blows <laughs> up all over the place. Shit, I've got snails on my face. I'm a snail killer. Nothing makes me iller when my feet hit the ground and I hear the crunchy sound. I'm a snail killer. Nothing makes me iller. Yeah. And then it just goes, I kill snails. I kill snails. I kill snails. I kill snails. <laughs> anyway. Well, hey, listen, that was the that's the tune of the century. <laughs> Where we played it, we played it uh, at the at my first gig in years at, in in the Magic Garden, and it was it was so good. Um, yeah, it was punky as fuck. So yeah, uh, it was great. Anyway, that's the, and every time I stand on a snail now, I just it, it just goes whoosh. I'm like ah snail. I'm a snail killer. killer. <laughs> Nothing makes you iller. <laughs> yeah, so there you go. Hey, it's well, thanks happen. thanks for sharing it's that. Yeah, man. That'll, that'll definitely that. take the edge off future snail murder. So I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, and and, and it's very catchy. And um, but you are, if you are, you're just a snail killer. And uh, mm. that's and, and and it's every time someone stands on a snail, that someone's going to go through their head now, mm-hmm. forever and ever. It's, uh, and it's going to be released soon, by the way. Just a little bit of plug in there. The Love Dogs. That's the fucking band. Snail killer. Love Dogs. Yeah. And, sorry. No, Love Dogs. Oh, yeah, love Dogs. Love Dogs are back, baby. <laughs> Kick it off. It's mad here, isn't it? <laughs>